I want to clear out something I just that you guys have been bringing to my attention. He been posting something saying that this is evidence that he never abused me. Justin slapped me at three months pregnant in the face. Justin, um, I lost the pregnancy before I had Athena. I don't know why you guys are asking me about this. I came all the way to LA to put my head by sister. Three days before I lost that pregnancy. He yanked me and I called my father on the phone and my father said I should leave the house. I should calm down. We were having an argument. He yanked me three days later. I bled and I lost the pregnancy. Yeah. I told you I would bring it out small, small, right? I've just been keeping quiet, but now. Small, small, you guys don't know. Chai, my people, wahala they say it be like bicycle. My people, Cora, obey the don't still come at a gate, can't debunk many things, consign as husband justice Dean. <laughs> my people now who go settle this their matter we just full grand break it so eh? because as they they break and this their matter don't they long for grand no be smoothing it be like and eh, this matter it eh, go past 601 years because una no say i they always they talk and before say this their matter go reach eh, 301 years but the way would they see all this their matter right now, my people, when eh, it go past eh, 601 years. Imagine Cora for here, they let us, they know, say, before she even gets that, eh, the, sec the second belay where she come born, Athena, so. Meanwhile, the first one where she first get before Athena, say, the way... Uh, the way justice the way happen to be his husband the way it a panebita now made the belly con delete commot eh, my people unbelievable this one eh, it surprised me when i hear this one for cora matt now there's so kind people for comment section con they ask cora obi to say ma pane beat you anyhow so tell to the s10 picking con wakaku like picking con delete and you still get my consistent for inside the relationship or inside the marriage you see come born another second picking again after the first one don't delete by the hair's husband my people wait to not think about this video because right now Cora or be the con they let us they know many many things for inside this video because I go see con drop the post way be say justice didn't say con let us know say he never beat uh, he never pan a beat uh, Cora or be the for inside their marriage I go see con drop that one for now because we can't they hear few months ago like that say this uh justy ding the pan a beat a wife anyhow that is a uh, cora obedi so justy they can't see post one picture one um write up like that to show say he no pan a beat cora na cora con they lie so cora na con con out con they let us they know say na lie Justin Dean, they lie, say, even Justin D pan a bit and so tape again, eh, can't delete. Make I just drop this video for now, make una watch and make una for here, by una self from Cora Mount. Anyway, my people, if today not your first time when you come across this channel, I beg, make you help me like and share this video. Subscribe to this YouTube channel, turn on the bell notification icon, so that whenever I bring a new gist, eh, you will be the first person to be notified by YouTube. Drop your comments, your opinion below the comment section, what you think about this video. Bye bye. Um, I want to clear out something I just that you guys have been bringing to my attention. He been posting something saying that this is evidence that he never abused me. Justin slapped me at three months pregnant in the face. Justin, um, I lost the pregnancy before I had Athena. I don't know why you guys are asking me about this. I came all the way to LA to put my head by sister. Three days before, I lost that pregnancy. Okay. He yanked me and I called my father on the phone and my father said I should leave the house. I should calm down. Hi. We were having an argument. He yanked me three days later. I bled and I lost the pregnancy. Yeah. I told you I would bring it out small, small, right? I've just been keeping quiet, but now. Small, small, you guys don't know. When I lost this pregnancy, of course, naturally, as every woman would, we have an argument. We've been fighting nonstop. And you yanked me. I was about to leave the house. You yanked me and pulled me by my shoulder. I, of course, blamed it on him. I said, hey, I think that it was because of our constant arguing. That's why I lost this pregnancy. And then I told my father that I think it's because of our constant arguing and 
when he physically yanked me when I was about to leave the room that I lost this pregnancy. In that text that he posted, he only posted the part where I said, how do I tell you that I yes, asked you? Da, 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 da. That, the prelude of that text message was, and I quote, how do I tell my father that? You did not yank me. You only tapped me. You did not slap me. You only tapped me like a baby's butt. You know, these are all. This is what an abused woman would do. Oh, he didn't beat me. He only slapped. He only tapped me. He didn't yank me. Only to. And that's what I was telling Justin. You didn't tap me. How do I tell? How do I tell my father that? Let's just let it rest. Let's just let it lie down and let us just forget about all of this. Let's just let peace reign. This was him telling me to tell my family that he didn't abuse me. I should tell my family that he didn't touch me, but he did. So I'm trying to make eggs. And, and now he's putting that up as his evidence that he didn't touch me. <laughs> but the only reason why I don't have the chat before that to post is because you broke my phone. So I don't even have the chats. <laughs> Cora, please, enough talk for now. You're making him restless and building up more lies. I saw him tagging Instablog Nigeria. Come, reach out to me. Instablog, reach out to me. He's desperate, man. She He's desperate to show the world, to cover his tracks. But I'm not keeping quiet anymore. You guys, I'm making eggs. I'm just going to put the eggs right very soon. Just seasoning some vegetables. By the way, it's oh. Nancy's kitchen. What? 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 <laughs> but the, the person who was always there, who was always there after every slap, after every every fight, after everything was nasty, and she had to block us at some point. She was like, "Boundaries, guys. I have my own family." Yes, he's asking Insta Blog to reach out to him. It's crazy. It's funny. I don't need to tag Insta Blog or anything. Mm -mm. I just I'm just here to speak my own truth and let it rest. It's fine. When everybody was calling me, I share what you cheat, I be you know cheat. Hey, nobody knew that he cheated. Yes, he has to tag his blog. I mean, he wants somebody's country blog to help take down his wife. Imagine. So that in the future it will be oh, Instagram publish something. If anything, it will be his affair that they will tag, they will, they will collect. And he's trying to deny the affair. Is what is what? Trying to deny the affair. Somebody, somebody that was saying that ha, she wanted to come to LA to be with you. Promised her everything. You promised her you were getting a divorce, and then you came back and impregnated your wife. And I said, "Oh, sorry, it was a mistake." And then she was heartbroken. And then now you're like, "Ooh." Why did you now impregnate me if it was a mistake? Such a mistake. And now the Athena that is kissing and rubbing every day. Oh my Athena! My Athena hey, was guys, a mistake to his girlfriend. How are you doing, guys? My one is that in this life everything should be equal. Keep your drama to yourself. This is for only dollars and attention. Hey, Karen. Hi. Um, no, this is not for dollars and attention. Unlike you, I am here to remove the smear from my reputation that has been done by my smear campaigner, aka Justin the Narcissist. And I am trying to clean up my name. I have been quiet for the longest time. Now I'm speaking. And this is not for dollars. Mm -mm. This is not for drama. Mm -mm. If anything, I'm always like, please, I don't want drama. But he already put it out there. This is me on my knees, kneeling down to my husband. Please, don't put our divorce public. He did what he did. No, but what's stopping someone from divorcing? If she did all these things, why can't you just... Divorce in peace and go. Must you go and call me all sorts of things in public? And then you were even having an affair. It's projection. Now, the thing is, all the mental health advocates here... You guys, I'm sure you can see this is textbook, right? Uh, you can see this is textbook. Everything. All the disorders people are giving him on Facebook. You can see how everything is playing out. Yes, good parenting. Good parenting is amazing, but huh, it's, it's unfair when only one side is being smeared all the time. And if he continues talking, she will continue to come out and she will continue to <laughs> debunk it because debunk I'm not going to keep quiet. Keep I'm quiet. not the sacrificial lamb that is the reputation is going to be destroyed. She will continue debunking it. She'll just come and destroy someone's reputation overnight. Because you are the white guy, everybody will listen to you. We're in a country full of <laughs> full of colonized people that, colonized people that, that worship, practically worship you. 
So everything you say must be true. It must be the, the woman that is lying, the, the black woman. Oh my god, opportunist. And the one that is always twerking online. I knew she was a slut from the right, from the get go. He oh. knows the advantage he has. So he's using it very well. But now, <laughs> when you tell the country's blog, reach out to me. Let me destroy your country woman. Reach out to me, please. You go. Insta blog, reach out to me now. Anyway. I am no longer quiet. I am hey, no longer... Please reach out to him, oh, because he needs somebody to help him do his work. Please reach out to him, because oh, it's not block. <laughs> it's not block, like, I was always block, saying the battle time... is not mine. The battle every is the time... Lord's. The battle is not mine. Their issue goes online. People are like, can you people rest? You know, rest, people rest. Panic. But now I'm cleaning up my reputation. They are still saying rest. No, panic. I people to rest when, when they, it's time to clear up. You should have told him to rest when he was destroying it. You should have told him, okay, we go rest. Oh, you were like, ah, ah, everyone's giving us attention. Oh my God, we must be so special. <gasps> Let him talk. He needs to talk. Men have their own feelings too. They need to voice out. They need to be holding it inside. And this is the of a guy. What's that guy's name again? Like, I don't even remember. I don't want to call him out. Don't call anybody's name and give them any clout, please. My goodness. He doesn't guys, deserve it. This again, uh, it's so long. I don't want to show it now because it doesn't look so fantastic. <laughs> it's not your cool. cool. It is to cook. You can't even get leave with the egg, eh? What are you eating with it? I don't mm. know. I don't know. Um, yeah. Got my voice back. I've got Better my voice, that voice back. Even after I've gone back. Because nobody is going to bully you anymore. That's why I flew all the way. You know how much tickets is? You know how much tickets is? I'm hiding behind my sister. Please talk to my sister. <laughs> you have seen a therapist. It's, see you guys. We are going through abuse. See a therapist, okay? See a therapist. Therapy Make is. sure that you you find someone to talk to. And if if all the therapists are saying the same thing, I mean, it's really sad. Imagine someone that is just a chiropractor arguing with me about public health, arguing with me about mental health. Person that doesn't know anything about mental health, trying to force a diagnosis down someone's throat. You are the one with the diagnosis. Okay. Imagine you carry calling Insta Vlog for your children's mom and you love those children so much with all your hearts. They are your life. You love them so much. Me, I'm just here to support my sister. I really don't care about what anybody says. When it happens to you and it happens to your family, you guys can go and spread mattress for the person that's abusing your sister. Let them sleep and enjoy themselves. In fact, when they finish killing your sister, throw them a party, a big party. That's not me. God forbid. I reject it. This will not be the first divorce. I really don't know why. God forbid, but this will not be the first divorce in life. And for all the women who have lost a child. It's always keep quiet. Look at you. We, you were so quiet. We loved your brand. We loved your Look at you talking about life. Why would I talk? People have talked about this girl for two months. Nobody said a word. This guy has been talking too much. Why is it now she's talking that, oh my God, you have to be protecting your brand. You see what they've done to your brain? Can you see what they've done to your brain as, a, as, a, as an African? You cannot talk. You can't support your own family. Because, oh my God, you have to be very careful because of the courts. You know, anything you do, everything you say. Oh my God, Nancy. I think your sister in trouble. And some people, oh my God, that wicked sister that doesn't want to bring peace to reign in her sister's home. Peace. There's no peace. Hmm. It's all destruction, you guys. There's no peace in the home. And instead of allowing someone to destroy your reputation, man, as well. No more destruction. I'm no longer the sacrificial lamb to be destroyed. Okay, if I'm not with her, I'm gonna destroy her. I'm gonna make money. I'm gonna take her to court. I'm gonna do no. By the way, guys, please follow my sister's new page. She was hacked. It's Dramaville over here. Like I just feel like God has been prepping me for this moment in my life because it's my sister's page has been hacked. So I'm going to tag her on this video, please follow. Oh yeah, my sister is no longer, like, she's done. She's done with all of the bull crap. She's done. It's called Russ Kitchen. It's called Russ Kitchen. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Her country's biggest blog to reach out to you so they can destroy her own country woman very well for you. Mr. Blog, that's that's that score. In fact, anyways, I like that they like to do their research. Anyways, they'll do their research before they accept anything. 
He's busy cutting, cropping messages. Post the full thing with your full chest. They boy you will post them. Post that full message with your full chest. Let me see. Uh, post the part that you want to get somebody else and leave your own part out. You guys, <clears throat> abuse. This is a story. This is the lesson for all of you. The lesson. What was I thinking? I met him on learning. Tinder. <laughs> As we are going, the whole world is learning from this lesson. Open your eyes. So say, go ahead and say, I do. If I didn't have my sister, what would have happened? I would not be able to clear my reputation. I would be I would be silent. What is that? How can you do that to somebody? How can you do that to a human being? Please follow Nasi Ume one. And I'm like, how would I have a page for this? Um, and I don't have a page. So that's what I did. For all yeah, of you I who are into mental health, I am the number one advocate for therapy. Please get therapy. Because without therapy, I wouldn't even have known what was going on. I had a song called Toxic Love. I was expressing it in creativity, but I was not expressing it to myself. I was lying to myself. And every day I'll wake up in the morning and paint this perfect picture of a perfect marriage because that was the only thing I could look at and say, okay, it's still good, it's still okay, it's still okay. Mental health is important. Four phones broken, smashed on the wall. Holes in the walls. Broken doors. Yes. I have not even started. I will, I will, I will get into it. So, get therapy, th guys. Therapy is good. Therapy is important. Yeah, I googled my divorce and the only thing online was was um the fact that I was a cheat narcissist and stuff. And this man mistress is reaching out to me. Mistress reached out to me, told me he loved me, told me he loved me. She told me he loved me. She was eighteen. Sleep with that idea, okay, okay. Come online, come and say, ooh, I'm tired of the constant cheating. You are, you are talking about your own true life story. It's textbook. You guys in the mental health institution, you know this for sure. Our egg will soon go. Let me show you guys. 